Well, a show of force by police in Chicago's Streeterville neighborhood. The area has seen a spike in crime this week with people robbed in broad daylight. Some of those attacks just minutes apart. Jeremy Ross is there live tonight. And Jeremy, a lot of finger pointing during the show of unity. Yeah, good evening, Erica. Yeah, concerns about muggings, carjackings, other types of violent crime resulting in the assembly of police officers earlier this evening. Neighbors calling that site comforting. Some others are still calling on much more to be done. Our purpose here is to show the community that we will not tolerate the criminal activity. The protection is yes, no totally inadequate. A show of frustration was preceded by a show of force and partnership in Chicago's Gold Coast. Chicago police lined up with Northwestern University officers, Alderman Brian Hopkins announcing NU's officers who have the same police powers as Chicago officers now have the same capability to respond to emergency calls CPD might field around campus. Up until recently, they did not have the ability to even communicate on the same radio frequencies as the 18th district. We've corrected that. They can now work as a team together. And reallocating some resources from Evanston just to be able to uh, keep our community safe down here. This public display follows a cluster of crimes Monday night. Three robberies in a three block span in less than 30 minutes. With crime scenes on Oak Street and a stretch of Lakeshore Drive, Hopkins telling CBS2 this week, Downtown areas experienced sexual assaults, an increase in carjacking, and two fatal shootings recently. As a result, the CPD Summer Mobile Unit, the Violence Reduction Unit, and additional Northwestern patrols hope to combat the disturbing trend. I am witness right now to one of the most aggressive deployments of additional patrol resources that I've seen during my time as alderman. Did you like what you saw? Did you like what you heard? Somewhat. We've we need to see officers. action Yesterday. and not speeches. Yesterday. I'd like to see it put in action. You can expect to see increased patrols here this evening. One neighbor telling us she was simply happy to see all the other neighbors out here all focused on crime. Live in Streeterville, Jeremy Ross, CBS 2 News. Brad and Erica. All right, Jeremy, thank you.